Yo, what's poppin'? Today, we gotta talk about young Dro almost throwing hands on the breakfast club. Now, this ain't your regular interview. Things got real spicy when Dro was on there with T.I., breaking down his journey to sobriety. Let's dive in. Now, everything was cool until one of their entourage members started heckling Dro, making jokes while Dro was talking about some serious stuff, like almost overdosing and his daughter battling drugs. The vibe shifted quick when Dro warned him. Hey, you finna get slapped, bro. What you mean, man? Hey, you finna get slapped. Bro. <laughs> I mean, we cool, but I slap the shit out oh, you by that. Man. Oh, man. Oh, man. I'm, just, I'm just telling you. Hey, you cool. ain't gonna slap me now. now what, what you wanna do? You ain't gonna slap me now. What you wanna do? Hey, you, you gonna hurt yourself. Yeah. Don't let him take you out of here. All right. Sober Dro. Come on, man. The heckler didn't back down either. Throw him back. You ain't gonna slap me now. And man, it was this close to getting out of hand. Dro was ready to throw down and you could feel a tension rise in the room. But T.I., being the OG he is, stepped in before things popped off. He told everybody to chill, reminding them, remember who you came in with. That calmed things down enough for the interview to move forward, but it definitely wasn't smooth selling for a minute there. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Luckily, Dro kept it real afterward and apologized for letting his emotions get the best of him. He straight up admitted, I got beside myself. I shouldn't have taken feelings to that. That's my dude right there. It was a genuine moment of reflection, showing that Dro on a different kind of path now. He's been clean for 17 months, but he's honest about how hard it is, especially in a game like hip hop, where the party life is always around you. Dro's journey to sobriety is no joke. And even though the pressure got to him during the interview, it's clear he's doing everything to stay on the right path. It's still a battle for him, being surrounded by the same scene that dragged him down before. But with his focus and support from people like Tip, Dro's showing us that growth is possible, even when things almost hit the fan. Do you think young Dro was justified in nearly escalating things on the breakfast club, or should he have handled the situation differently? Let's chop it up in the comment section. Stay locked in for the next headline. I got some more crazy hip-hop tea to leave.